Imagine waking up as a vampire in a hostile world where every decision impacts your survival. This isn't just a nightmare, it's your new reality. Welcome to V Rising, a game where darkness is both your haven and your battlefield. Developed by Stunlock Studios, V Rising transports you into a gothic world where you must navigate your existence as a newly reborn vampire. Avoid the scorching sun, hunt for blood, and build your very own fortress of darkness. Whether you choose to stalk your prey alone or rally with friends, every choice you make could lead you to dominance or doom. In today's video, we'll dive deep into everything V Rising has to offer. From the innovative survival mechanics to the expansive world filled with lore and danger, I've got you covered. We'll explore the key features that set this game apart, peek into the mystical world and its inhabitants, and wrap up with the latest updates on the game's release and what we can expect from the future of this thrilling survival adventure. So sharpen your fangs and ready your senses, let's rise into the shadowy depths of V Rising. V Rising is not just another entry into the vast world of survival games. It introduces a refreshing twist by immersing players into the life of a vampire striving for resurrection and dominance. The concept centers around survival in a hostile world, but with a supernatural edge. As a vampire, you are not just battling hunger and enemy factions, you're also constantly avoiding the deadly sunlight and managing your blood resources to maintain your strength and powers. The game is brought to life by Stunlock Studios, a Swedish game developer known for their work on Battlerite, a highly acclaimed multiplayer arena brawler. With V Rising, Stunlock Studios takes a bold step into the survival genre incorporating their signature top-down combat style into a rich, open-world experience. Their history of creating games that are both challenging and engaging shines through in the meticulous attention to details seen in the gameplay mechanics and the atmospheric world-building of V Rising. The core gameplay elements of V Rising revolve around three main pillars, survival, crafting, and combat. Survival. As a vampire, your first priority is to manage your exposure to the sun. Daylight is lethal, forcing you to find refuge or use special gear and abilities to shield yourself. The survival aspect extends to hunting wildlife and human villagers to satiate your bloodthirst, which not only sustains your life, but also grants you various powers depending on the type of blood consumed. Strategic management of these resources is crucial for your progression and survival in the game. Crafting. Building your castle is central to your dominance in the vampire world. Crafting in V Rising goes beyond simple resource gathering. It involves designing and fortifying your castle to protect against both the elements and intruders. Crafting also includes creating coffins, weaponry, and magical artifacts that enhance your abilities and influence. Players must explore the vast world to gather rare materials and blueprints needed to craft more advanced items and structures, turning their simple hideouts into formidable fortresses. Combat Combat in V Rising is intense and strategic, with a focus on real-time battles that test both skill and tactical planning. Players can engage in combat with a variety of melee and magical attacks, each offering unique advantages and effects. Combat isn't just about fighting enemies, it's about utilizing the environment, choosing the right targets, and knowing when to strike and when to retreat. PvP elements add another layer of complexity, as players can choose to confront other vampires, raid their castles, and defend their own domains from attacks. These gameplay elements are interwoven with a dynamic world that reacts to your actions, creating a compelling and immersive experience that pushes the boundaries of traditional survival games. Whether you're navigating the intricacies of vampire politics, engaging in fierce combat, or mastering the art of dark alchemy, V Rising promises a unique and thrilling adventure into the night.
In V Rising, Stunlock Studios has crafted a game that goes beyond traditional survival mechanics by integrating unique vampire-themed features that set it apart. This section delves into the key features that make V Rising a standout title in the survival genre, the vampire mechanic, building and crafting systems, and the interplay between PvP and PvE elements. The Vampire Mechanic Daytime VS Nighttime Gameplay at the heart of V Rising lies the vampire mechanic, a feature that brilliantly captures the essence of being a vampire. This mechanic significantly influences gameplay with its unique approach to the day-night cycle, pivotal for survival and strategy. Daytime risks. During the day, vampires must tread carefully. Sunlight poses a fatal threat, rapidly depleting health if exposed. Players must use the environment to their advantage, seeking shade or using special crafted items like sun-resistant cloaks to navigate the dangers of daylight. This adds a layer of strategic planning to daytime activities, whether you're raiding for resources or exploring. Nighttime Empowerment Nighttime is when vampires truly thrive. The darkness not only shields them from the sun's lethal rays, but also enhances their powers. Nighttime gameplay allows for aggressive expansion, hunting, and gathering. It's also the ideal time for players to engage in combat and exploration, utilizing their full range of vampire abilities without the debilitating weakness caused by the sun. Building and crafting, establishing and defending your castle. Building and crafting in V Rising are central to establishing dominance in the game's world. Players are tasked with constructing their own vampire castles, serving as sanctuaries, bases of operations, and fortresses against enemies. Castle building, starting with a barren plot, players gather resources to construct their castle piece by piece. The game offers a variety of architectural designs and defensive structures such as walls, gates, and towers, which can be customized and expanded. Your castle is your stronghold and reflects your progress and power in the game. Crafting system. The crafting system is intricately linked to the player's growth as a vampire. As you advance, you unlock recipes and blueprints for more sophisticated gear and stronger fortifications. Crafting also includes brewing potions and concocting elixirs that enhance vampiric abilities crucial for both survival and combat effectiveness. PvP and PvE elements, fighting against players and AI-controlled enemies. V Rising offers a rich blend of PvP player vs, player and PvE player vs, environment elements making each playthrough dynamic and unpredictable. PvP combat, PvP is a significant aspect of V Rising. Players can choose to raid other vampires' castles, engaging in sieges and battles to loot resources and claim territorial control. The game's combat system requires skill and strategy, allowing players to duel one another using a mix of melee attacks, ranged skills and vampire powers. This competitive mode encourages players to form alliances and participate in large-scale vampire clan wars, adding depth to the social and strategic dimensions of the game. PvE Challenges Aside from PvP, the game is populated with numerous AI-controlled enemies, including wildlife, human villagers, and elite bosses. These enemies provide essential resources such as blood, which is necessary for sustaining vampiric powers. PvE encounters often require different tactics, as enemies have unique behaviors and weaknesses. Dungeons and special event areas offer complex challenges and rewards, pushing players to refine their combat and strategic skills. Both PvP and PvE elements are seamlessly integrated, ensuring that players must constantly adapt and optimize their strategies, whether they're fortifying their defenses against a player-led siege or coordinating an attack on a powerful AI boss in the depths of a cursed forest. V Rising immerses players in a richly detailed and atmospheric world that captures the essence of a dark, gothic vampire saga. The setting, lore, and narrative are intricately woven together, creating a compelling backdrop that enriches the gameplay experience.
Let's explore how Stunlock Studios has crafted this hauntingly beautiful world and integrated its lore into the very fabric of the game. Setting and Atmosphere The world of V Rising is set in the mystical land of Vardoran, a realm shrouded in darkness and mystery dotted with ancient forests, decrepit ruins, and forgotten castles. Each region in Vardoran has its own distinct environment, from the eerie, fog-laden forests of Silverlight Hills to the harsh, unforgiving deserts of the Golden Sands. The atmospheric design is further enhanced by a dynamic weather system and a day-night cycle that not only affects gameplay but also adds to the overall mood. Nighttime in Vardoran is particularly mesmerizing and terrifying, with shadows lurking around every corner and the soft glow of the moon illuminating paths fraught with danger. Lore Behind the Game's Vampire Mythology In V Rising, vampire mythology is not just a backdrop but the foundation of the entire game. The lore delves into the origins of vampirism in Vardoran, presenting a world where vampires were once mighty rulers but have been vanquished and driven into hiding. The player's character is a vampire who has awakened from centuries of slumber, weak and vulnerable, striving to reclaim their ancient power and restore their dominion over the land. The game features a unique blood system that ties directly into the lore. Players must feed on various creatures and humans to survive and grow stronger. Different types of blood not only nourish but also grant specific powers based on the victim's attributes reflecting the deep, mythical connections between vampires and their prey. This system encourages players to explore the rich lore behind each creature and character, adding depth to every encounter. Integration of Story Elements into Gameplay The integration of story elements into the gameplay of V Rising is seamless, enhancing the immersive experience. Quests and missions are not just tasks, but are pieces of a larger narrative puzzle. As players explore the world, they uncover ancient artifacts, engage with other characters, and discover hidden texts that reveal more about the history of Vardoran and the lore of vampires. The story-driven quests lead players through haunted graveyards into battles with legendary beasts and into alliances with or against other vampires who have their own agendas and histories. Each storyline is carefully crafted to make the player feel like they are part of a living, evolving story. Furthermore, the player's castle acts as a personal hub where much of the game's lore can be explored and displayed. Here, artifacts and trophies collected along the journey not only serve as decorations but also as reminders of the adventures and the lore uncovered. The castle itself is a narrative element representing the player's rise from ruin to the resurrection of their vampiric dynasty. In V Rising, the gameplay mechanics are designed to immerse players deeply into the role of a vampire, where every aspect of the game from combat to exploration is influenced by vampiric abilities and necessities. This section provides a detailed exploration of these mechanics. Detailed look at combat systems. Combat in V Rising is visceral and strategic, demanding a blend of quick reflexes and thoughtful planning. The game employs a real-time combat system that allows for fluid movement and action, letting players dodge, dash, and strike with precision. Players can engage in melee combat using a variety of weapons like swords, axes, and spears, each offering unique attack patterns and special abilities. Moreover, combat isn't just about hacking and slashing. Positioning is crucial due to the game's use of a directional attack system. Players need to aim their attacks and abilities with care as enemies will not simply stand still and take hits. They dodge, parry and counterattack, making each encounter a dynamic battle of wits. Stealth plays a pivotal role too. As a vampire, you can choose to approach situations with subtlety stalking your prey from the shadows before striking. This approach is particularly useful during daylight hours when direct confrontation is riskier. Exploration and Resource Gathering Exploration in V Rising is rewarding and engaging with a vast world filled with secrets, dangers and resources critical for survival. 
The landscapes of Vardoran are diverse, ranging from dense, misty forests to sprawling plains and desolate wastelands, each teeming with resources and hidden locations. Resource gathering is a continuous necessity. Players must collect materials like wood, stone, and precious metals to construct and upgrade their castle. Blood is a resource too, essential not just for survival, but for maintaining and enhancing vampiric powers. Players must hunt various creatures, from wildlife to human villagers and enemy vampires, each providing different types of blood that bestow various buffs and abilities. The game also features a sophisticated crafting system where resources can be turned into tools, weapons, and mystical items. Exploration often leads to discovering rare components needed for high-tier items, encouraging players to venture into the unknown. Role of Magic and Abilities in the Game Magic and abilities in V Rising are where the gameplay truly embraces the vampire theme. Each vampire possesses a basic set of abilities which can be expanded and customized through a skill tree. These abilities are not only used in combat, but also affect exploration, resource gathering, and even social interactions with other players. Abilities are categorized into different schools of vampire magic, such as blood magic, shadow magic, and frost magic. Each category has its unique utility and combat functions. For instance, blood magic might allow a vampire to siphon health from enemies, while shadow magic could enable temporary invisibility to escape or ambush foes. Additionally, the game includes powerful ultimate abilities that can turn the tide of battle. These abilities require careful timing and strategic use as they have significant cooldowns. The use of magic is not limitless, it consumes a resource called blood essence, which must be replenished by feeding on enemies. Magic also plays a role in non-combat situations. Some abilities help in detecting resources, unlocking secret pathways, or manipulating objects in the environment, which can help in accessing hard-to-reach treasures or escaping dangerous situations. V Rising is not just about individual survival. It's a game deeply rooted in community and multiplayer interactions where alliances and rivalries form the core of the player experience. This section explores the importance of these relationships, the different server types, and the community-driven events that keep the game dynamic and engaging. Importance of Alliances and Rivalries In the world of V Rising, no vampire is an island. Alliances are crucial for survival and progression. Players can form clans with other vampires, creating bonds that allow for shared resources, mutual protection, and coordinated attacks against common enemies. These alliances can control large territories, manage resource-rich areas, and establish dominant presences on their servers. Rivalries, on the other hand, bring a vibrant competitive edge to the game. Competing clans can challenge each other for territorial control, leading to large-scale battles and sieges. These conflicts are not only about power, but also about strategy and diplomacy. Rivalries can shift the power dynamics within the game, with betrayals and alliances reshaping the political landscape. The ongoing tension between cooperating for mutual benefits and competing for supremacy makes the social interaction in V Rising complex and thrilling. Server Types and Player Interactions V Rising offers a variety of server types to cater to different playstyles. PvE servers, these servers are ideal for players who prefer to focus on building, crafting, and exploring without the constant threat of being attacked by other players. PvE servers allow players to engage with the environment and AI enemies, perfect for those who wish to delve deeply into the lore and world-building aspects of the game. PvP servers, for those seeking a more confrontational and dynamic experience, PvP servers provide the opportunity to pit against other players in battles for dominance. These servers test not just individual skill, but also strategic planning and teamwork. Mixed servers, these servers offer a balance of PvP and PvE elements, allowing players to choose when and how they engage with others. 
This flexibility can suit players who enjoy a mix of cooperation and competition. Player interactions in V Rising are facilitated through a robust chat system, trade mechanisms, and cooperative missions. The game encourages players to communicate, trade resources, and collaborate on challenges, fostering a community that can adapt to the needs and styles of its members. Community driven events and updates. Stunlock Studios actively engages with the V Rising community using player feedback to shape the game's development. Community driven events are a staple, providing fresh challenges and rewards. These events might involve special boss fights, unique crafting opportunities, or temporary alliances to defeat common foes. Regular updates also introduce new content and features, keeping the gameplay exciting and new. These updates are often influenced by community input, ensuring that the game evolves in ways that the players find meaningful and enjoyable. For instance, new vampire powers, weapons, or enemy types might be added based on popular demand or to address balance issues highlighted by the community. As of now, V Rising is in a promising stage of development. Stunlock Studios has opened the game for early access, allowing players to dive into the world of Vardoran while still fine-tuning aspects of the gameplay. This phase is crucial for gathering player feedback and making necessary adjustments before the full official release. The official release date for V Rising has not been set, keeping the community eager and attentive to any announcements from the developers. The anticipation builds as updates and patches continue to roll out, each adding layers of depth and polish to the game. Expectations from the gaming community are high. Players are looking forward to expansive updates that might include more complex storylines, enhanced world dynamics, and broader multiplayer features. The unique blend of survival and vampiric lore has set a high bar, and the community is buzzing with discussions and predictions about the future content and the directions in which the game could evolve. V Rising promises to redefine the survival game genre by blending it with rich vampire lore and complex multiplayer dynamics. We've explored the innovative vampire mechanic with its day-night implications, the intricate building and crafting systems, and the engaging combat involving both PvP and PvE elements. We've also delved into the atmospheric world of Vardoran and the deep integration of story elements that enrich the gameplay. As V Rising continues to evolve through its early access phase, the anticipation within the gaming community grows. Each update brings us closer to seeing how this unique title will finalize its vision of vampiric survival and domination. If you're as excited as I am about stepping into the dark and mystical world of V Rising, don't forget to hit like and subscribe for more updates and deep dives into the game. Have any thoughts or predictions about the game's development? Drop a comment below, I'd love to hear what you think about this blend of survival and supernatural adventure. Join the conversation and let's keep the excitement going.